Okay, what we have here is a common problem in the valet industry. We've got two sets of keys left over and we're ready to close up shop for the night and these people haven't come to pick up their vehicles yet. So what we've designed here is a clear token valet key lockbox for after hours. Okay, so we'll open up the door on the cabinet here and what we've got here is three electronic key latches and they're each labeled one, two, and three and you can have up to 15 keys in, in there. Uh, we just happen to have three in this in this demonstration unit here. And we've got two different types of keys here. We've got uh, basically your standard set of keys where you get a key on a key ring and of course your valet ticket there. And we just simply take this key ring and we push it up there and we hear a click and now it's it's firmly in the electronic key latch. And then you got a case where you got key fobs right with no real way to hang them up there. So we've got our valet ticket in the bag there with this and basically we just take this, this uh, little pin here and we just latch that up there and that holds the key fob type thing here okay now what we do is we open up our the clear token app and from the administrative side for basically the the valets at the end of the night they simply select uh, open up the app put in the ticket number this is 78733 and this is on electronic key latch number two and then we'll just go ahead and assign that Okay, and then this one here, the number on that one is 78798, and this is slot number three, and we'll assign that. Okay, now we are done with the app, and we are ready to go ahead and close this up, lock up the cabinet, and put the padlock. Okay, now we're going to switch gears. I'm the customer and I've shown up to the valet station after hours and they're of course no longer there and I look on my valet ticket there 78733 after hours call this 1-800 number. So I call this 1-800 number and I talk to a service agent who in, who at first thing they ask me is what is my <coughs> ticket number and I give them that 78733. In the first phase where the valet loaded in um, my keys into a particular slot number, they're accessing that from the back office software. Uh, they then ask me for my cell phone number, they settle out any charges that might be associated with the valet parking, and then they text me instructions on how to download the app and which, which uh, key slot my keys are contained in. Okay, I've received my text message now with instructions on how to download and install the ClearToken app. Uh, we'll simply open up the clear token app and it will scan for devices you'll see mr003 which is the box number here that corresponds with the label on the key box we're going to connect to it and the instructions that they gave me was door number or uh, uh, number two which is the key slot number two for mr003 and so now i just simply select that door and i select keys down here authorize it make sure I'm authorized and it will drop my keys I'm simply ready to go now I've got my keys and I'm off okay so just to reiterate that process again here I'm now going to be the person with the other set of keys there seven eight seven nine eight and I'm going to call the after hours number they're going to go through the procedure of getting me all charged out sending me the text message with instructions to install the app and which door number we've got there. So in this particular case I've got the app already installed and what they did is when I gave them my phone number they authorized me for door number three and only door number three. If I tried to use any of the other doors it'll tell me that access is denied. So I'm going to select MR003 and I'm going to select door number three and I'm going to select keys. Okay, and now I've got my keys and I can be on my way. So that concludes the demonstration of our valet box here. Demonstrated everything from the standpoint of the valet, from the customer who utilizes the valet service, and from the 24-hour back office uh, telephone service that uh, runs everything there. So if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact us.